Alright guys, we're back for another Dokkan Battle video. So today we're going to take a look at another one of the 50% supports, the Attribute Easies. Uh, this is the last one I needed to do a video on. Uh, this is Hit. Hit is pretty good. Um, I think that the two STR um, Attribute Easies are probably the best. I mean, one of the reasons is they have very good super attack effects, which helps out a lot as well. Now, I built, I EZ8'd this guy and made his build back in January when he first got his EZA. Um, I'm looking at this. I'm not sure if I want to keep this. So, remember, hit greatly stacks defense. And then we have some raw defensive equips here. I'm not sure if maybe I should play more into additional, try and get him more points for additional, or maybe give him an additional slash dodge build. I think that could work well. Right, like I could probably do something like 24 additional and then like 16 dodge, something around those lines. That could be pretty good. Um, I'm not sure. I think just for this video, I'll, I'll leave it like this though. Um, the raw defensive equips certainly would be good um, towards making his uh, defense look higher, which is one of the main kind of like points for this hit. But yeah, I mean, in terms of building him... I would say additional raw defense or dodge, any of those three should work well. Keep in mind, too, that Hit, of course, is like one of these, you know, Universal Survival Saga, you know, tournament participant type characters. And those categories have been getting a lot of buffs lately. And even in particular, the team we'll run them on today is Topo's team. So let's go ahead and jump into a fight and uh, see how effective uh, Hit will be. All right, guys, I think we'll rock something like this. Uh, let's go ahead and jump into the... By the way, I'm running Jiren. I, Jiren, I know, I know. But I, dude, I couldn't help myself. I was going to run Rabanra, Zarbudo, and Zerloin. Um... All right, our rotations are pretty bad. We're th This could be death. Uh, the only thing about a team like this, like kind of like the build we're rocking with and stuff like that, is it's very easy for us just to end up dead. <laughs> Right, because like Topo and Pride Troopers are uh, basically just a loser without another Universe 11 character around, which we don't have on this rotation. Uh, SCR UI Goku's gonna need to come through. If he doesn't, we're dead. Um, I could have put Hit in slot one. Hit member does guard for the first two rotations, uh, but Hit is gonna stack as well. Um, so we're in this fight. I probably will at least get one um, fight as well where I stack Hit up a lot. Remember, Hit is supporting UI Goku. Please dodge it. No way, dude. Today is rough. Oh my god, today has been so brutal. What? What? Harutagarn and UI Goku. Oh my god, dude. Alright, it's fine. It's fine. The thing is, is that we I have three attempts left in this Vegeta fight. Um, and we have uh infinite topo friends, because there is a dev friend topo. It's alright, we had a bad rotation anyway. It's it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Here, let's not use the rainbow friend one. Let's use the Dev friend one? Yeah, right there. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Um. Oh, God damn it. Dude, I hate doing real fights when it's like, if, if you're not using just the elite of the elite, you could just get cucked so easily. Let's. Uh, we'll float hit or Jiren. We'll float Jiren off. Let's do this. Uh, we do want to give you orbs. Let's give him a lot of orbs. I'll try and save the SCR orbs for hit next turn. Uh, do our best to. Uh, okay, so I could... S uh, this time, though, the Topo and Pride Troopers have a Universe 11 ally on rotation. So we'll be able to go ahead and float the Topo and Pride Troopers safely. That'll that'll be good. That'll be, we'll be able to do that. Because um, what I want to do is I want to have, you know, Topo plus a Topo and Pride Troopers as one rotation... Um, and then on the other side, you know, we'll be focusing on hit. Uh, but, like, opening rotations matter a lot. Uh, I mean, we are running... We're only running one shitty character, to be fair. That's Jiren. Uh, UI Goku, you know, is a goddamn, damn dumbass idiot moron for not dodging the super attack. Uh, but besides that, I mean, UI Goku's obviously good, but... Jiren is not. <laughs> but I had to run... J Jiren is a really good link partner for... Um, uh, hit. Uh, okay, so Topo and Topo and Pride Troopers, neither of them are supporting Hit. Um, remember that Topo supports uh, Defender of Justice and Special Pose, which Hit is not on. And then Topo and Pride Trooper, they support Universe 11 and Special Pose. So unless we're talking about 
the the Dragon Ball Super dub version of Hit, where they said Hit from Universe 11. Uh, Topo and Pride Troopers are not supporting Hit, unfortunately. All right, let's hit this right here. Uh, Hit is guarding, because we do have three other STR allies on, on the team, so Hit will be guarding fine. Uh, we have no... Vegeta can't touch us on this turn. Because, you know, we have Topo and stuff like that, so we're good. Okay, sure. So here's Hit Super Attack. Six million. Um, not the craziest, but remember, we do get a 10% chance to crit per STR keys here, which we saw right there. And then Hit does greatly stack defense. So he's only going to get stronger and stronger and stronger. Um, Hit is pretty solid. I did use him. I it, we, we used him in two of the missions for the ninth anniversary, right? I think we beat the Beast Gohan Extreme Class mission with Hit. And I think we also beat the Cell Max Extreme Class mission with Hit. If I'm not mistaken, Hit was on both of those teams. Because there are no... None. There are no good Extreme SCR characters. Like, I'm actually... That's not a joke. There is zero good Extreme SCR characters. I, you know, understand and remember that we did, unfortunately, just uh, go through the biggest power creep of all time. So, you know, an Extreme STR, like, you know, all those guys, they're all donezo. Um, UI ain't failing us again. Number one thing I will do for y'all, I know... Uh, it seems like I'm the only one. I'm on an island alone about dodge, even though it's obvious how good it is. But I will not deny you guys the opportunity to see dodge characters fail. You know this. I am a man of the people. What y'all want to see is dodge characters failing. I'll make sure you get a chance. Oh, you, I please, dude. God. Bro, I, like, I know I'm telling the speech, but like I, half of it was meant to be jokes, you, I. Jesus, dude. This bastard. I hate this guy. This UI, for some reason... Oh, dude, UI, please, man. Okay. This UI, I just have bad luck with. There are certain dodge characters even I have bad luck with. SDR UI is one, and Harutagarn. Those are the two. Most other dodge characters I'm very confident in. EJL UI, Carnival, Gogeta. They can always get caught, but... To be fair, in these ninth anniversary situations... Uh, you, dodge characters that can get caught... I mean, you put 99.9% .9 of regular characters in the same spot, and they die too. Like... Right. Unless you're talking about Beast or Evolution Blue Vegeta in a lot of situations, right? Like, you're going to get cooked. Are we below? We're below 50. Nice. Perfect. Okay, we're going to get this ability in easily. Actually, UI helped the showcase. Good job, UI Goku. Perfect. So. Oh, damn. Ha, 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 That's the first time I've seen that. I, I you know what? I, I am prone to making a mistake or two, you know? You know, I do, I do. Okay, so remember the type supports will change the whole field of orbs into the same type orb. Um, and then, you know, you get a ton of healing. You know, it, it, stats get crazy. Um, everything is very good. But, 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 you do need to have for, so like for Kabe's super class, no, Kabe, uh, he needs two super class characters on the team. Hit needs two extreme class characters on the team. To be fair, the entire team here is super class. Hmm. I mean, hit. Uh, I mean, okay. So here's what we're working with right here. That ability actually would be kind of tough for hit. These are his 200% leader skills. Let, let's just look at his categories. Let's look at hit's category. Well, here, we can do it right here. All right, so hit has Universal Survival Saga, Universe 6, um, Target Goku, Rapid Growth, Space Traveling Warriors, Legendary Existence, Accelerated Battle, Tournament Participants, and Super Bosses. Uh, I mean, it's difficult for Hit to be able to, you know, be an extreme STR support and then also have the multiple villains. Because, you know, on this team, the entire team is super class except for Hit. Right? Like, I've seen people refer to villain as, or Topo as a villain, but Topo's not a villain. He, he's a super class character. So that, th it does matter when we're talking about missions, right? Like, you know, they, they do missions where you need, um, you know, one of every super class typing. You need one of every extreme class typing. I, I mean, these are real missions. This is real things that does happen. So, all right. That's a little unfortunate, but it is what it is. We will move forward positively, all right? Full heal right there. What's our defense? He's at one point already? Let's look at this link set right here. This is a big reason why, right? So, we have experienced fighters, cold judgment, that's why. 
In Fighter, Warriors of Universe 6, Shocking Speed, Turn of Power, and Shattering Limit. Cold Judgment, Shocking Speed, and Turn of Power all giving defense, including Cold Judgment, the massive 25% defensive link right there. What happens if, if he's not linked with Jiren? Yeah, look at the drop. Look at the drop right there. That's crazy. Uh, all right. Well, when we die because of Jiren in two seconds, it's all good. <laughs> it's all good. I think we've already seen that hit is good. Hit is just naturally above a million defense already after one super attack. Uh, okay. Hit him a 10 system additional normal, unfortunately. Uh, remember, Topo, again, is not supporting hit. Please don't super Jiren, dude. I can't. Today is, is going to be a brutal day of recording. This is the second video I'm recording, and we're just encountering all types of shenanigans already. Please don't. No! <laughs> what do you guys want me to do, man? What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do, bruh? Please tell me. <laughs> Come on! We're using Jiren! <laughs> I mean, I could consider the video a success already. We got two seconds in and hit was over a million defense. That was pretty good. That was insane, dude. Yeah, we're going to super Jiren. Thanks, bud. Um, I tell you what. Hit is good. Like, I feel like we established this within two seconds. I'm just going to come back on, like, turn 10 or something like that. Um, with hit, you know, having stacked a lot. And, you know, maybe let's see hit with some nice stats. I guess I'll just go into the that showcase stage I like to use, uh, where you know the Zamasu's immortal, the um, villain immortal event. We'll just come back and like yeah, again, like turn ten or something like that, and see what hits defense looks like. Um, you know, a full additional build could work, but the only thing is hidden potential system additional normals will be very unfortunate for hit. That's that's the only thing about that. All right, guys, we can go ahead and grab this rotation right here. I still would like to let hit stack up just a little bit more, but uh, we'll be able to grab this right here. A uh, lot of orbs. Uh, remember that Kabe is supporting hit a little bit. Um, by Kabe being on rotation, he is giving 10% attack and defensive support. Because um, remember, Kabe, of course, is the super STR support. And hit, of course, is extreme STR. Um, I'll, you know, we'll come back on like turn 10 or so. Uh, let hit get some stacks in. Uh, let's see how it goes. Hopefully we get some hit and potential system additional supers. But Oh, perfect. There we go. And we saw hit stun as well. So again, his super attack effect, uh, what he gets is he gets the 50% defensive stack, supreme damage, and then a high chance to stun. The stun being added on could be good, right? Um, hit basically is the good version and Vegeta is the bad version. Vegeta stacks attack and then, you know, stuns. And hit stacks defense and then stuns. But like the stack attack does nothing. Whereas the stacking defense for hit could be very useful. Um, in a lot of runs. Now, wh when you're, you know, running through, like, Supreme Battle Spectacle stages and stuff like that, hit stacking is not so he could live supers. Remember that it's more so that he could survive normal attacks. That's a big thing to keep in mind with that. <laughs> Alright, guys, here we are in turn 10. Let's see what our boy Hitto is looking like. We'll be able to grab a bunch of orbs. We'll get a Dokkan attack. <laughs> Apparently 3.3 million, so... Yeah, the way hit works um, with his stacking, it gets very silly very fast. Now, I mean, when we're talking about 3.3 million, now hit is able to survive just with raw defense uh, some of these super attacks from these big bosses. And, I mean, imagine Red Zone Movie Boss Rush. I could probably do a specific showcase in Red Zone Movie Boss Rush just for hit, and it would be a good video. Um, I mean, hit would be type disadvantage against Broly at the end. But, I mean, getting to Broly on turn 14 or something like that is not unheard of. Not impossible. Yeah, so this is double digits by a thousand million light years. That Goku Black does 850k and hit was at, you know, after Super and what, like 3.5 million defense right there? 3.6? Yeah, hit is solid, man. Um... You know, like, I could definitely get behind full additional build for hit. I'm not sure what to... I'm actually really not sure. Should I leave him how he is? Should I lean more into additional? Um, I could give him the gold equip that's dodge plus defense more so just to get more raw defense on him. Because I do think 
that the raw defensive equips stack well with the defensive stacking. Like, it works well. So, I'm not sure. I mean, I, this is... This is a care. I, I think additional raw defense or a dodge, any of the three, um, really would work pretty well for this hit. All right, guys. So, this hit right here, he definitely looks pretty good. And again, remember, I, I did use hit um, in several of the ninth anniversary extreme class missions since extreme str is just so it's a barren wasteland we gotta get a new extreme str monster character soon so this is evolution to match strength hit um his leader skill is extreme str key four and 150 percent of stats his super attack is the time skip which greatly stacks defense, does supreme damage, and then has a high chance to stun the enemy. So that's a 50% defensive stack and then 50% stun. 50% um, defense over multiple turns is just really good always. It's what makes Int Go Tank so good. Um, it's what really helps Physical Ribrian be really good. It's what made Tech Ultimate Gohan so dominant for years, right? That, like, when you're getting that level of defense across multiple turns, you know, you're just in a good spot, period. Uh, hits passive is resistance through evolution. He gets STR type key three and 10% attack and defense. Uh, then he gives an additional 50% attack and defense for extreme STR types. He changes key spheres of a certain type to STR. Um, then he gets 50% attack and defense per key sphere obtained. And then an additional 20% attack and defense and 10% chance to crit per STR key sphere obtained. So hit is getting 70% attack and defense per STR key sphere. Then he changes all STR key spheres when HP is 50% or less, and there's another two extreme class allies on the team. Uh, and then he guards for the first four turns with another three or more STR type allies on the team. Um, that ability doesn't really matter too much in a lot of the ninth anniversary content. Again, I guess outside of Cell Max, but I mean, for like Hit or Kabe or Kid Gohan. The guard can kind of just be the initial little push, and then their super attack effects can get them to more reasonable defensive levels. Again, I, I the, my expectation for these characters, I you know after the massive gigantic power jump of ninth anniversary, it's tanking normals. I I I know I just you know like it, like if these a lot of characters could just tank normals, I could take it right. Like at this point, if you're not running Beast or Blue Gogeta or Orange Piccolo or you know, UI or Vegeta with their easy revives to save the team. If a boss doesn't just line up a super against your best defensive character, you probably lost. It's just, it's the ninth anniversary power creep is so massive. It's just how it is, right? Uh, then uh, hits links are experienced fighters, cold judgment, in fighter, wars, Vunero six, shocking speed, turn up power, and shedding limit. Um, and then his 12 multi is 140%. Um, and then finally, our boy Hit is on uh, several different category teams here. So Hit, of course, is on the Universal Survival Saga team. Uh, we've had a lot of buffs to that recently, which is good. Uh, then Hit is also on Universe 6 as well. So Universe 6, especially once JP catches up and gets Physical Goku Black. Um, and then, of course, you know, we get Tech Khalifa's EZA, SDR Kale's EZA, uh, Vados is EZA, and then, of course, Kefla. Right, like just this big batch of characters down here. That will help. Oh, and also Int Hit as well. I think Int Hit is actually not too bad either. Um, that batch of EZAs was very good. It, it's just like the batch of EZAs JP just got. Very, very good. Uh, then there's the Target Goku category team that Hit is a part of. Okay, cool. Uh, Hit is also on Rapid Growth. Um, any options for Rapid Growth is really good. Uh, then Hit is on Space Traveling Warriors as well. This inconsistent ass category right here. Uh, Hit is also on legendary existence. Okay, sure. Uh, then Hit is on the accelerated battle category team. Hit is also on tournament participants. Uh, and then finally, Hit is on the super bosses team. So, a super bosses buff. We're not mad about that. So, there's Hit. I think he's pretty good. Uh, definitely one of the better uh, attribute EZA characters. Him. Kabe and I think Kid Gohan are the best. Now, the last thing I want to do real fast here um, is I just want to follow up with my point about there being zero good extreme STR characters. Look at this. None of them are good. None. But I mean, Hit would be the best. It, Hit probably is the best character on the screen. There's actually zero good extreme STR characters. Isn't that insane? Like, you see, I'm not making it up. Look, 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 look. There's no good extreme STR characters, man. <laughs> I didn't make it up. I'm not just talking shit. It's true. There's zero. 
Zero good extreme SCR characters. Is that not insane? Zero. This is like extreme STRs, the modern day extreme tech, bro. It's crazy. So I'm praying we get like some extreme STR option. And it does matter before people will say like, oh, it doesn't matter. It does because they make missions where you need one of every extreme typing. So you need to bring an extreme STR character. And right now there is literally zero good extreme STR characters. So hopefully we can get like a Dokkan Fest or something soon.